With the MBBR process, operators can maximize treatment capacity while minimizing their footprint. An MBBR system is a fraction of the size of a conventional system and can be built without the need for a return activated sludge stream, allowing for a single pass process. Additionally, the HeadWorks Bio MBBR biofilm process is self-regulating, automatically responding to fluctuating organic loads without the need for operational adjustments. HeadWorks will work with your consultant to customize your MBBR system, configuring your new plant for the applications your discharge permit requires. Full treatment of municipal wastewater, industrial wastewater, or treating wastewater for reuse. Also, standalone pretreatment or post-treatment reactors can be used with existing systems. Let's walk through an example of the MBBR process designed for total nitrogen removal. To begin the MBBR process, influent from the headworks passes through a fine screen and enters the treatment system. Free-flowing biocarriers are distributed throughout individual reactors and effluent screens act as sieves to keep the biocarriers within each specific reactor. A mechanically mixed anoxic reactor combines the influent stream with a recycle stream from the nitrification reactor. At this point, nitrogen is released into the atmosphere in a process called denitrification. The next reactor is for BOD and or COD reduction and requires approximately 2 to 3 hours HRT. The high level of carbon food source in the influence stream maintains a rich concentration of heterotrophic bacteria living on the biofilm, which is required for BOD reduction. In the third reactor, the influent has low levels of BOD, limiting the growth of heterotrophic bacteria and contains high levels of ammonia, supporting the growth of autotrophic bacteria on the biofilm required for nitrification. The nitrification process oxidizes ammonia to nitrates and nitrites in order to meet the required discharge levels. After the MBBR process is complete, clarification removes suspended solids from the treated wastewater. At this point, the effluent is ready for any optional tertiary treatment. The HeadWorks Bio MBBR aeration and mixing processes produce a continuous sloughing rate which maintains a more active biofilm. Treatment capacity can easily be expanded by increasing the fill fraction of the biocarriers within the reactor as much as 70% by volume. At equal levels of BOD removal, HeadWorks Bio's MBBR provides up to five times the biofilm surface area of a trickling filter using less than a quarter of the reactor volume. When compared to an activated sludge extended air process, MBBR saves time as well as tank space. Whereas activated sludge is designed for 12 to 24 hours of hydraulic retention time, MBBR needs only 2 to 3 hours to achieve the same level of nitrification using a quarter or less of the tank volume. HeadWorks Bio has designed and implemented MBBR installations for municipal and industrial applications for 15 years, including resorts, cruise ships, food processors, power plants, and petrochemical plants. If you're building a new treatment plant, HeadWorks Bio can provide an MBBR solution to meet your capacity and treatment requirements.